Hello everybody, welcome to 35th State Fishing. Today we're at a newer uh, public access point that was built uh, near Beach Fork Lake. Um, so make sure and hit those uh, like and subscribe buttons and stick around, let's check it out. Welcome back everybody. So if you've seen any of my other videos, we normally start down near the water, but for this one, there's a little bit of walking involved. So we're actually gonna start at the parking area. And like I said before, this is a newerly built section. So the parking lot is gravel. And you can see it's fairly close to the road and it's not actually that big either. There's probably enough room for six, six cars comfortably. But if we come over here grab my fishing rod we come over here we can actually see where the main access points at now there is this little runoff that comes into it and this is where they are expecting people to fish now I know the water is a little muddy right now and it's actually up a little bit than what it is in the summertime Normally on hotter days, I will actually go wade fishing on up the creek for, I would say, close to a mile. And there's actually some really good bass fishing there with just regular soft plastic bait. But if we go on down, there's actually another spot that we can check out. Um, it's quite a walk down, so just stick around and we'll be back to it. So we finally made it down to the other fishing area. And you can see here just a little shot of the water. Now this bank is not nearly as steep, but that's what you got to walk down to get to it. And then when the water levels down a little bit, you probably can't see it from the video, but the the bank actually goes out about another three feet right here along the water's edge. So the amount of space you have is actually pretty decent to fish here. And this one's mostly used for catfishing. You can see all the way up there is where we came from. Not very far. It's about a hundred yards maybe. But also, if anybody's interested, all that land is public hunting. So now let's climb back up the hill and see what else we can find here. So you can see there's a little path cut in that leads quite a ways down through here until eventually you're going to get to a real sharp left-hand curve in the creek. That's basically when it stops. Um, I've walked it a few times and there's not really any other good spots to go fishing. I just wanted to let everybody know and show you there we go we'll take another shot of the creek now if you wanted to come out here and do some catfishing you could do that from this path without any trouble bass fishing those you could do it but it's it'd be really difficult to not get snagged up on anything because there's stuff like those trees and briars all on the bank and in the water right near the edge. But this is one of the main feeder streams of Beach Fork Lake. And in, even though the lake itself is at Winter Pool, 
it's down about I think it's almost eight feet from what it is during the summer the water level through here does not change very much unless it's just rained or we're in a drought so I didn't video this on the way down but this is the path leading back up to the parking area and if you look right here there's plenty of water that looks like it'd be some good fishing it's just not accessible because all these briars and stuff get in the way during the summer you can however walk down right there and stand on that tree and fish now i have not personally done it because the water is about six or seven feet right there and i just didn't feel like falling in some more shots of the water you can also come down right here and get on those trees and do some catfishing during the summer it's not really easy to cast out very far because the trees and everything's are in the way but for catfishing it's doable now I'm not sure what they were doing here but this tree being down is new um, I don't know how long it'll take them to come and clean it up chances are they probably won't it'll be done by somebody that uses this area a lot as you can see there is also a second tree down let's continue heading up towards the car truck rather there is one last area that is decent for catfishing if you feel like climbing to get to it and that is right here after I turn around it is right there it levels off some when the water levels down and you can cast over to that tree that's in the water that's been there for years and do cat fishing and you can also get underneath that tree and this technically this hill slipped in the last couple years so you could probably get down right there too and catfish if you wanted but i mean that's it that's the that's the fishing area this was built i think I think three years ago three or four give or take and it's not bad to bass fish during the summer um, I've walked up the up against the current rather and uh, caught several but not decent sized bass out of it so if you want to know where it's at just uh, hit me up on any of my social medias and head over to 35thstatefishing.com um, there'll be a blog post and I'll, I'll drop a pin and show you where it's at um, it's definitely worth checking out if you like bass fishing if you like cat fishing you could drop a kayak in you could wade fish you can really hit pretty much all the boxes with this one so everybody just get out there and have fun